This is my fifth design to try to get something useful out of conductive ABS filament. This is just like a linear potentiometer. Um, you can get about a 4-bit resolution out of it. Pretty smooth, works okay. Uh, if you're trying to build stuff out of conductive ABS, it's not, it's not easy. Uh, so there's a couple of tricks to making it work. One of the tricks is that when you print, you want to print it vertically like this so that you get long continuous lines running the whole length of the conductive element. Yeah, I should say resistive element. Um, I also use copper tape to um, form the connectors at that two ends. And the other trick is since this um, conductive ABS changes its resistance with even the smallest amount of pressure or any type of bend, so your straightforward designs of just having like a little wiper that goes right above it uh, doesn't work because it applies pressure at different points and the resistance changes as you move the slider. Uh, so I came up with this design that has a little spring to it. Um, so these spring elements will apply a constant pressure um, all the way along. And they also touch on both sides, which increases the surface area and seems to help. So basically I just use this uh, conductive copper tape and I put it um, on both sides here to form this wiper. Uh, and then and then I put copper around here and I have these rails, these copper rails that it runs along. And so in the end you get this. Um, and so it has copper here, copper connected to copper up here, and this forms a little slider thumb that just runs along these rails. <clears throat> um, and it works, and it works okay. Uh, it works because it doesn't really change the pressure as it moves along the, the, um, this conductive ABS. And then, uh, so I'd like to create a better design. This is just the one, the first one that actually works okay and isn't fluctuating all over the place and gives you enough resolution to do at least a, a one digit display. Uh, but I think uh, some of the newer conductive ABS materials that will be coming out that I hear about, um, the resistance is uh, cut down by order of magnitude. Right now it's in the mega ohms and um, getting it down by that much would help a lot. Uh, so looking forward to some of the new materials coming out.